In this one, we finally make it to the Githyanki crash. I meet a literal god, but can they cure the tadpoles in our head? Let's find out. This is part 13 of my full Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough. I don't care how long it takes, we are going to get to the end of this game together. I'm loving it, and I hope that you are as well. I would imagine if you're here at part 13, you are, so perfect. Thank you for being here. This one starts with us coming out into the mountain pass where I was immediately ambushed by some ghasts and some skeleton dudes, at which point combat ensued. I don't really want to start this video with a long combat fight, so we're just going to skip past the bit where I turn into a huge owlbear and kick them into bones, and we're going to go from here. North, so Rosy Morn Monastery. West, Moonrise Towers. North it is. So we aren't going to Moonrise just yet. It's like an area where the... This view is almost worth the walk. Gorgeous. Wow. Wow. I mean, even in a video game, that makes you say, wow. Imagine that in real life, or seeing something similar in real life. Not that I'd get that close to the edge, because scared. No one stopped me yet. Take your breath away. Better not be cursed. Approach the fairy in Lathander's grace. May his gaze shine upon you, pilgrim. Still got my cup of tea. I got a bit distracted by that fight. Cable car wheel. Difficulty class 15. Can I? Can you exit out from a dice roll and like give someone else a go? No. Oh, if I use a, a strength potion, I get a plus four. Let's try. Nice. Good roll. That was tough. This can't have been used in a while. Comes before we ride it. What's down here? Anything? A chest. Arrow of roaring thunder. I keep sending arrows to Astarian, but he's just always casting spells. Pretty much never actually uses his bow. On everyone, please make sure all limbs are inside. Good boy, staying still. Are we going in a temple? Monastery. Where are you going, Scratch? Still alive, so that's progress. You found something, boy? I didn't exactly dress for hiking mountains. Shame we can procure some pack mules or horses. You found something? <laughs> Those ill-tempered beasts are prone to biting. Well, so are you. We all failed the survival of seeing what is here. Even though Scratch found something. Rides, if that's what you're thinking. I think you can still manually dig. Because of Scratch. Let's see if you found it. Good boy. A loot. Some gold. Elixir of bloodlust. Okay. I believe we're approaching the crash. Once we're inside, let me do the talking. Alright. Just to be clear, are you going to lead us into a nest of geese Yankee marauders? And we're supposed to trust that will end well for us. I've got a long road ahead. That's about the sum of it. More 
a sign of the times, I suppose. <gasps> Bird. Wait, I don't have thingy. I've got nothing left to take, so you might as well shove off. Did someone steal something from you? Steal? Eagles are bigger. They just take. Nest, prey, everything. <clears throat> That's how it works here. That doesn't sound very fair. It's not bloody fair. I got there first. The eagles don't even need it. Attack the whiny bird. Well, surely the eagles need a nest as much as you. Not on top of the monastery, they don't. Oh, it's not even like the eagles need my nest. The drunk lizards they eat aren't hard to catch. Try and figure out what these lizards might be. Do a little dicey roll. Oh, so close. Alcoholic lizards didn't show up much in your studies of the natural world. Do you want me to go and deal with the eagles for you? <laughs> you? Kill an eagle? <laughs> but if you think you can, then please, please kill the eagles. They're the worst. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. I'll think about it because I don't really want to um, hurt an animal. Oh! There's mines everywhere. Ah! Still breathing, despite everything. Good thing I went forward and not off the edge. Man, this area is really making me feel like we're on an adventure. Like, this is some fellowship hiking going on here. Did I go backwards? Oh. I just did a little circle, didn't I? Um. Let's get on with it. What you doing? This is just another route from the... <sighs> Guys. No time to rest. I just, I just climbed. B okay, all right. It's just another way. If you if you fail the check of bringing the, uh, you know, ski lift up. Morphe sense of direction. I mean, I'm just exploring. I, I wouldn't have found the bird otherwise. I'm just making sure I find everything, guys. Gosh. Obviously. Oh, and we left a star in behind. He's not a big fan of jumping. You guys aren't following me, are you? <sighs> well, look who it is, spending a bit of quality time together. have each other's backs for a little bit. Let's get you down here. I felt like our destination was here, but I got distracted by um, Scratch's sniffing. Shadowheart, what's, why are you scared of jumping all of a sudden? Synchronized jumping. Hello? Action, not reaction. Believable. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Right. Don't waste the step. We're back on the road. How many die today? How many die tomorrow? 
What's up this way? Ah, that's where we came in. And what's all this? An elixir. Maybe I need more pocket. Pilgrim's Prayer, Pilgrim's Curse, some gold. I think it's left there as tribute. A waypoint. Is there a front door on this thing? Let's get going. Save it if stuff's about to happen, eh? It auto saved, okay. I have a lot on my mind. Seeing some red enemies on the map. That's enough. On your feet. Where are you taking us? If this is about that weapon your friend was talking about, we don't have it and we don't know shit about it. Silence! Move! No! No, 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 I'm not going in there! I won't! Anyone want to join her? As I thought. Through the doors. Now! The captain is expecting you. Forward, carefully. These cultists have the crash on high alert. Ruthless. Let's see what she had in her pockets. So the Gith Yankee aren't fond of the cultists. Could be a good thing. Knock, knock. Within the artifact, a feeling stirs. Uncertainty. No knock option. Your curiosity is getting the better of you. Do not let it. Stay away from the Githyanki. They're hunting you. They want the artifact. They'll stop at nothing to take it from you. Okay, voice, but also we need to, you know, explore no and rest. feel everything. And that is my curiosity getting the best of me, but it's what has to happen. The invisibility. What are you seeing? What are you pointing at? Scratch sniffing here. Shovel. Nothing interesting buried here. Hmm. What is it, boy? Let's climb up here. <clears throat> Gotta find a way in, I suppose. I just thought we'd be able to knock on the door. Mishka, a cat. But now we're up here, what do we do? Maybe we break through this and then we can get in. A couple of cats in there. You don't seem to be friendly either. I don't wanna I don't wanna hurt a cat. Shadow heart. What am I to do? What are you to do? You have to jump over here with us. Because you're slowing us down. Is that no, never mind. What now? Hmm. breeds madness. Okay, let me save it. Let's break this and see what happens. Thump. 
Okay. Still breathing, despite everything. It's only an attack. Can we use my animal friendship? Where is that? Speak with animals. Animal friendship. Convince a beast not to attack you for ten turns. Condition ends if you or an ally hurt the target. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Let's give that a go. Pass without trace. You and all nearby companions are plus 10 stealth checks. Maybe we can pass without trace on them too? If this doesn't work. Because I feel like this is only for one animal. Do you know what? Maybe we try that first. I think animal friendship. It's 10 turns. I think it's only you. It's as if an ally hurts the target. I'm not sure. Target must be a beast. That doesn't even count. It's in ambush mode too. Okay, let's try the other one then. Pass without a trace. Everyone together. I don't know. If, I mean, I could... What? You just turned into panthers. Been spotted. Oh no. There's so many of them. Panther polymorph. What is a Grimishka? They're like cute gremlin cats. Oh. They don't react well to- Oh, when you cast a spell, they react, and that's why they turned into panthers, because we cast a spell. When I cast that spell, they changed. Lacks a chill. Ah, okay. So I kind of made things worse for us by trying to be nice. We just have to use melee. Or wild shape, I suppose. Doing, doing, doing. I'll bear it up. I'm guessing I'm far enough away that if I cast this and then I jump in. Then we should be okay. But I can't get in there right now because we're kind of blocking the way. Miss this. You should be able to misty step, right? What is that? Why is there a baby crying in here? A child. That's what I said, dude. like hitting the cats. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Misty step requires a long rest.
Okay. I think we're going to reload here and now knowing what we know, put ourselves into a better position with that. This seems like a very strange way of entering the crash. Like, what? We have Lazel with us. Why isn't there a doorbell? Someone in the comments. There is a doorbell. If you missed it, it was right there. Push the button. Oh. Oh. Be invisible, you just saw this bringing us up. Okay. So, no. Spells. Oh. Um. Didn't mean to recast speak down. Let's just go ahead and try that again. I'm gonna move over here. Can I go? So hopefully it doesn't trigger them. We're going to become the owlbear. Okay, that was far enough away that they didn't trigger. My face protects me. Cast your spirit. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. And enough waiting. I crave blood. Well, we'll, we'll go with that. Should be okay. And let's have you just go ahead and fly on in here. Yes. The less magic, the better, or they'll be friends. Got it. Stay out of the way for a second, Scratch. On the move. Why can't you reach destination? It's just a little step. It's an itty bitty step. I didn't know that was a spell. Oh, I suppose. <laughs> Who would win an owlbear or all of these cats? Is sounds like a sort of poll, doesn't it? Get Shadow Heart diving into the heart of battle to help me. Nothing will stand in my way. Feel bad. Oh, I'm sorry. Swift and lethal. Let's jump you in. anything from here? Much easier this time. Ancient Githyanki warrior up here. These boots have seen everything. Oh, missed one. Should have stayed quiet. Good job, everyone. Let's never speak of this day again. 
Uh, why are you taking a, a tail for memories if you never want to... Might be useful. I said we never speak of this day again. What's this? Parables of Dawnmaster. It's locked. My faith will guide me. Let's crack it open. Nice. Rare books, you say? An epic looking tome that opens with an illustrated panel of Dawnmaster Vasid riding into battle against an army of Sharon clerics. In his raised hand, his trusted battle axe, its sharp edge glinting in Lathander's light. How much books go for is crazy. Because obviously I love books. I have my podcast where I read books. And I thought, wouldn't it be nice to maybe buy some sort of rare books? Maybe for like books that I've finished on the podcast as like a nice little memory, a little sort of celebration. Because I like collectibles. And I looked up some rare books. Good Lord, books be expensive. Like, first editions of books being 80 grand or more. Like, everything I looked at was between 3,000 all the way up to, like, 90,000, which, fair enough, was, like, a sort of first edition Lord of the Rings. But I just went on, like, some rare books on Google and a rare books web website where they sell them. But, jeez. This missile commemorates the founding of Rosie Morn Monastery. For my sins, it only just occurred to me that I had lacked in my record-keeping of late. But then again, I, no, we, have been busy. In our fray with the Sharon thieves, we retrieved the blood. But one of the heretics sinned more heinously. They struck the amber encasing his blood with a maul of pure void, damaging the most holy relic. As if knowing of this blasphemy, the exposed blood shone with an unbreakable radiance, reducing the Sharon Horde to dust for us to sift from this now holy ground. The relic became far too unstable to carry back to Hap. Thus we fashioned a simple chapel around ourselves here, and have encased the blood within steel to be wielded as the most righteous cudgel against those who sit in shadow. To keep it from the lustful sacrilege of thievery, our simple chapel will become a great monastery, and the blood shall be secreted away, secreted away, with a great many whales than it was before. I find it hard to fathom that we left such an artifact in such an obvious open space to begin with. Alas, his light singes away the mistakes of the past, leading to a more fortuitous dawn indeed. Can you tell that my book podcast needs a lot of takes? Now what about this crying baby? Still alive, so that's progress. Let's have a little short rest. Off we go, then. What was that sound and where did it come from? Who allowed the pilgrim to pay for a wine with a cat? What sort of cat even is it? One of my novices told me they saw it grow to the size of a humongous hound. That was moments before it attacked. The poor novice didn't stop trembling, trembling for a ten day. Please, I beg of you, can we just accept gold for goods like ordinary folk? And for God's sakes, call on someone to get rid of that nasty animal. We exploring potion of animal speaking. Learned. Um. Ah, another barricade there. I see. And this door. And another Let's door. Let's see what this does. And another door. Let's see what's in these. A rooftop. This goes up to there and seems to be going through. Well, let's 
open that locked one up because locked Keep means goodies. A crooked touch. How delicious. Very nice. What's in here? What to do? A chest. Scroll of lightning bolt. Scroll of haste. Tongs. Rope. Is that it? Is it a way up to something? Jump, jump, jump. Potentially, but breathe deep and move. Where's this one go to? Same place, I, I think. Put my hands on everything. Yeah. Oh, what have you got? Found something? Through here? What is it, boy? That might be worth a look. Let's see. necklace and some gold. So I guess if your survival skill sucks, having scratch with you is another way to find all these sort of secrets. Though I will say, we haven't dug anything good up yet. It's literally a little bit of extra gold and some junk to sell. Nothing too special. It's down here. I can't quite see. It's glowing over there. An enchanted door. Guardian of the Faith. Damage is halved. What are you sniffing? Can it be lockpicked? Easy. Well, you said easy, and then you missed by one. Confidence comes before the fall, Starin. Although pride is the actual saying, but sure, it's fine. Good job. Um. Guardian of Faith. And this is all... Never a dull moment. Is there another way in here? Are we going to jump into here? I think we should save it. Do you jump over? Seems like a terrible idea, doesn't it? A Guardian of Faith spell. And a remarkably long-lasting one of them. One by one. Maybe don't step over the line. The Guardian of Faith spell. Need to find a way forward. So what are you protecting? Something good here, I hope. Hmm. Wasn't too much there, was there? I'll give it a shot. Still me. Even after everything. This is curious.
Not sure if we want to tussle with you. It doesn't seem like I can talk to you, though. What are you guarding? Maybe it's this ceremonial battle axe? Ah. I tried to use my psi powers to just move it, but he freaked out. It still detected it. Oh. Um. We should leave. We should grab the axe. And then we should leave. Lazel would so hate having to run from something. Okay. I think we're good to just carry on. Wow, you have to get really far away to end combat. Fleeing from combat sends you back to your campsite? Oh, just the one who flees goes back to their camp. Okay, we all fleed. And we're back. Well, I guess we'll just end the day and rest whilst we're here. And then we'll see what we do the next day. No combos to be had, so we'll just go straight to bed. Let me out, let me out, let me out. Let me out of what? Oh, it's my fairy, isn't it? It's not me. impossible. There's an iron gate here, though. His holy blood. His radiance has faded from our unworthy gazes, O ye lightless wretches. We have failed the morning lord, and I record that failing in the pages of this tome. To think he once stood on our imperfect world among us imperfect orf Let's try that again. <laughs> to think he once stood on our imperfect world among us imperfect mortals and felled the villain Samister with his holy brilliance. He bled for us, brethren, and we were tasked with locking our gazes eternally upon his blood. We let those gazes falter, and the blood was taken, wrenched from our sight. It is a test, one that this chapel is duty bound to undertake. I pass the keeping of this record along to Paladin Vasid, chosen in light to find the relic. Paladin, when you look upon the blood, I pray Lathanda honors your deeds by burning out your eyes. On my way. Okay, very nice, and we're finding all of the lore, but how do we actually get inside? Beloved morning, Lord. The blood of Lathanda spilled in holy battle with Samister, immortalized here for all to worship. They kept the blood of the panda here. Please, this is this place it was begged of the golden age to lay thine eyes upon the blood of the panda. A lot on my mind. Feels so weird just sort of exploring a dungeon without too much combat or even people to run into. I just feel like I'm sort of in a maze. Entrance to the crash. Ah, finally we found it. Save. Watch there be a really easy route down here. I'm just an idiot. Here goes nothing. Totally possible. Hello, hello. Guess we'll have you do the talking. Onward. Sentries to arms! Istic, state your purpose quickly! Stand down, Gish. Is it not Vlaketh's command to welcome her faithful? I expected no visitors faithful or otherwise. Why have you come? Allow Lazel to answer. We seek the Sathis. Shadowheart disaproves? Oh no, baby. 
I won't you let her speak again. Infected. I'm sorry. A geek thrall is something to eradicate, not reason with. The faithful may be purified. This is Vlacket's protocol. Fine. Let the Gustil carry out your fate. Report to the infirmary at once. And step carefully. Crescia like watches you. Okay. I would be more concerned than excited. Can't give up now. Can't slow down. What's that? A prison? Alaka. Dead. Do we know who that is? A tiefling. Wait, was it the Githyanki that took them? I thought we were going to be saving the tieflings from Moonrise. Here we go. I heard they're making us join the patrol soon. An Istig? But you can't be here. I can't be seen with you. That's your cry. Quenny Rel, the Inquisition have more to worry about than who you talk to in the corridors. Hmm. Okay. Um, I'm with the Inquisition. Tell me what you were gossiping about. Charisma? I have none. But I am saved by my favorable beginnings. Nothing, Rastil. We were only talking about what you already know. About the weapon. The one the Kifrat can't find. Uh, Quanirel? Keep your mouth shut. You're going to get us in deep, Skva. Um, no, definitely don't keep your mouth shut. The Kithrak is very worried about the Gake threat. Before you came here, discovering what is happening in Moonrise Towers was our main focus. We heard the Kithrak say the Inquisitor is wasting her time with this search for a weapon. We! Don't bring me into it. I know when to keep my mouth shut. The weapon being what Shadowheart has, right? What's happening here? Walk freely. This place is as tight. Kachoki! We are training to fight Geek. You think they will hesitate? They won't need to if we keep killing each other for them. I it's stupid. Orphy. Silence! It seems your childish prattling is attracting an audience. You fight again. This time, daggers only. And to the death, as instructed. Who wants to challenge this snivelling Istark? That facial hair is a choice. Killing your own soldiers is an odd strategy. Cowards are not tolerated in our ranks, though I gather they are welcome in yours. Hmm. Bring him to the edge of death. Leave him asking why he deserves to live. Stand back and relish or persuade? May as well do a persuasion. 21? And I rolled a 1. Well. And yet here you are, pathetically pleading for the same useless mercy. This is how we deal with a weakened enemy. Ah, a true warrior's kill. Quick, bloody, and a scream to curl the stomach juices of Vlakith herself. Move him out of the way. We've wasted enough time already. Wow. You are well on your way to being gate food. Do better. Did you see that? The look on Varl's face when the blade went in. Oh. I want to have a word. Out 
outsiders aren't supposed to see us training. You... You should leave! <laughs> uh, the children of the different, like, races in this are so funny. Unless you want to be set up as target practice, I suggest you leave, Istic. Right. Well, who am I looking for? Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Is it different if Lazel tries to talk to them, I wonder? Repositioning. Go quietly, kin. The sur ah. There you go. Assume nothing. Have you lead everything? You are right. Gate have six major arteries. No, wait, seven. Stop distracting me. I have to learn this or the Savash will get angry. Again. Teaching them how to kill. Did you see that? What a wimp. I'm way braver than Val. Follow the waypoint, I guess. Just so. You stand before a truly resplendent portrait of Queen Vlakith in all her glory. In the corner of the painting is a small symbol you can't quite place. That's like what's on our armor. Draw a new face onto the portrait. Inspect the symbol. As hard as you rack your brain, the symbol doesn't look like anything you've seen before. That's what's on our chest. On, uh... Doors, well, the look, ends. isn't it the same? Not as kind of? As it could have. This imposing portrait depicts a powerful Githyanki warrior. Undeniably regal in her mien. Isn't that cool how it changes Lucky depending on who looks at it? She is both the sun that blinds us and the void that contains us. Praise be. In the corner of the painting is a small symbol you can't quite place. Study. This Githyanki, the way her stark white skin stretches over her sharp features, gives her a distinct. So I didn't even get to roll a history aspect. thing. Hey, Shadowheart, watch this. You'll love this. Check this out. The things we do to impress people. Oh dear. Oh god. Um. Just as you find your flow, you slip. <gasps> Perhaps you should leave before someone notices. It didn't even impress her. Oh. What is this? What's that? I need to get rid of it before the Inquisitor sees. What's next, I wonder? Not the artistic breakthrough you were hoping for. It has a certain unorthodox charm. Maybe if I'd succeeded, she would have been impressed. Seems simple enough. <laughs> hmm. Is there someone in there? I should speak up. Not now, Kachuki! We're busy! What is in the chest? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Whatever it is, I think you should stop. Mm, no. Yes, let it out. Nah, we're having fun! Look here, you little shits. I said stop. Fine. 
if you're going to be a big baby about it. I'm wondering if it's an animal, a and because I have baby. speak with animals, I'm hearing Open it as a it person. Up, then. It's all yours. Starion. How oh, for a skeleton key? It reacted when I did a spell? Is it a gremlin cat? Maybe it'll be, like, friendly now. Oh. Maybe not. Sorry. Sorry about that. But it's still sound coming from the chest. Mess of an eye. Let's move. Moving in. Sorry about that. I've not met Istic before. Do you all look like that? No, I'm a particularly attractive one. What's in here? Had a ring. Where are those kids gone? Little punks. I'll give it a shot. Journal updates. The doctor's office. What is this thing? What are you doing? Mm. The Zathisk is not a child's plaything. If you require its services, speak to me. Otherwise, leave. Parasite specimens. Research notes. There's a parasite nearby. You should take a closer look. You were interested in the Zathisk. Do you have a question? Or are you just going to stand there gawking? I am a child of Gith, not discarded rat flesh. Am I not due your respect? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Let the Istic with you speak. And I will decide what respect you're owed. Is that... Things host still alive. A very specific question. One that speaks of a more personal motivation for asking. I can only deduce. You have a parasite of your own. Hmm. Merely curious. Not sure I trust you yet. Curiosity without toil is like a broken viewing glass. Unfocused and incapable of insight. Let's see what knowledge your labors have borne so far. Tell me. What is your understanding of ceramorphosis? Morph. Explain it to me. The stupidity encouraged on this plane never ceases to amaze me. Listen carefully. The tadpole is a parasite. Once it consumes enough of your brain matter, it instigates an excruciating transformation. 
Every fiber, every sinew of your being is torn apart and reformed into the repugnant flesh of a geith or illithid. That is seromorphosis. So what you're saying is don't let it eat your brain to unlock um, special powers? Or, um, I mean, look, I haven't told you everything, okay? I'm infected. Is that so? Conscious of the tadpole's presence, yet able to pretend otherwise. Fascinating. You aren't the first istic to require my treatment. Though you're the most lucid by some margin. Either your tadpole is special, or you are. Oh, thanks. We must find out which. Go to the Sathisk. I will ensure you're cured. What's that going to do exactly? It will relieve you of the specimen lodged in your cerebral cortex. What else? It will be worth it, I assure you. Even Gith Yankee rarely experiences Aethys. You are very lucky, Stick. Listen, I'm aware this is probably a really bad idea, but I am the CEO of making bad decisions, so I'm just going to go and stick myself in this. The device is strange, made of taut flesh and pockmarked metal. Oh. It waits for something. The Zathisk. Vlacket's purity distilled. My duty. My right. Uh, examine the device. Or not. The device is part organic, part synthetic. Stand aside! My time has come. I mean, shh, go for it. Praise Blacketh. Let it be done. Sit, child. Let the Zathisk end your suffering. It's about to kill you. You must focus on the parasite at all times. The Zathisk will do the rest. Oof. It's like being at the dentist. Equally as terrifying. An unseen blade cleaves your mind in two. Impossible pain sears your bones and body in concert with Lazelle's. Yeah! <sighs> Yes, child, speak the Talakit. Meditate on its verses. You feel Lazel's mind rip and rupture. Is this purification? Is this the cure? Hmm. I'm... Persuade, get out of there, you won't survive. Wait and watch. I mean, let's see what a star in is just like. Oh yes, look at what's happening there. That's interesting, isn't it? Screaming and writhing in pain. Hmm. Let's see what happens. You share in Lazel's agony. Every cell within her skull bursts into a constellation of fragments, sorted and reassembled. Lazel will die if she remains. Yes, child. Jamar Zala Blackith, call to your queen. <gasps> My queen, hear me! So we're just going to stand here and let it kill her? Is, is that the plan? Your vision narrows. You sense myriad spectres of Githyanki past. This is their fate. This is their anguish. We should get her out of there. Seek answers. 21? Oh my gosh. Oh. Not good. Not good enough. The pain is too great. 
her visions flicker but refuse to come into focus. I want to roll again. This is their anguish. Nice. Got it. Lazelle's life is laid bare among those that came before. Her thoughts are turned to silver thread and relayed to the astral sea. The voices of the dead cry out as one. The Zathis collects memories from the infected and executes them. It is not for curing. It's for killing. Okay. If they tell her then... 21 again? Is that enough? Oh. Inspiration. power and take it as your own 30 good I mean it's not even possible it's not even possible how would you get that Zathisk overwhelms the both of you. The weight of the astral sea crushes your mind and spirit. Enough! Damn it all! The parasite! I still feel it! I am Githyanki! I will not be gay! My life's work! Gone! And yet she lives. And so does her parasite. Her voice cuts with a fanatical edge, an obsession bordering on mania. If there's a chance the parasite lives, she wants it. Um... The parasite lives, and thank goodness it saved her. It saved her? And it destroyed a Zathisk. Then its power is even more unique than I thought. I must examine it. Since the Zathisk did not extract it, we must resort to more traditional means. Wait here. I will gather my tools. I followed the protocol! I must be cleansed! That was too close. You were lucky I was... I followed protocol. I kept to my faith. Yet the Zathisk might have killed me. The gust still tampered with it. Traitor. And there may be more still. This must be why the Inquisitors come. It's supposed to kill you. I saw it for myself. A deception. Proof of the Doctor's manipulations. The Queen does not mislead Gith's children. Now hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Doctor's sedition. I don't know about that. Path? Let's take the specimens. Parasite, brimming with magic. 
Take it. I can really How use all of these. I just Take unlocked it. three. It might be useful. Oh my gosh. Her research notes. External presentation consistent with previous samples. Intestinal coloration is not. Internal fluids discolored. I need to spend some time reading about the magic in this land. My studies in Tunarath, extensive as they are, do not cover whatever the magic this is. I need to retrieve similarly unusual samples to deduce a pattern. Well, she's gotten to get her tools, so we should uh, get out, maybe. Read these two. Infirmary Where's records. Well, maybe look at them, rather than just... A list of Githyanki names and the treatment they received. It's written in common tongue. The name of Val comes up 47 times. Savage Ketk, far be it from me to tell you how to do your job, but may I suggest doing something about Val? He's a drain on resources, not to mention interrupting my research. I'd like to go through at least two days without seeing him again. Let's head out. Been locked in. Careful, I might. Simple. Can't contain us. All right. What now? Oh. Tested only. Leave enough to study. Maybe you can. the Githyanki. Well, got a surprise for you. Do you want to just scooch on back out there? Thanks. <laughs> Can we lock the door? <laughs> Well, gotta get this guy now. Action. Nice. Job. Focus. Ah. Swing and a miss. Spiritual weapon will guard the door. Let's have some carnage. Right. You can't do anything. I need to give you some potions. I keep forgetting. Can I just misty step you to safety for a minute? Invenient. I like how it changes the fog of war out there because the door's shut. They're going to have to crawl through all of this spike growth to get to us. Ah, concentration broken on spike growth. Damn. They're still out there. Plant growth. Make weeds burst from the ground. Smother the area. They have their movement speed quartered. would give us time, but why would I do that over just the spike growth? Just recast it. And if I've told you once, I've told you a million times, get back out there. Or do I heal a Starion? You're more important. Oh, this is the guy with the facial hair, right? From the thing? He looks the same. 
He is no more. Hiding. Whoa. What was that backlash? To me casting that. That was weird. Backlash, one to four psychic damage for every level of that spell. Nice. Should have left you in that corner. Okay. Cool lightning. I didn't think... Okay, like casting another spell, I need to be more aware of that interrupting what I'm doing. Albert time. much damage. Probably one of us should have grabbed the Starion. Never mind. I don't think I can get him from here, can I? Oh, I can. Not enough movement, though. Damn. Can we not see? Like, why? Perfect. Get you out of the way for a second. Good job. I'm hoping this isn't a goblin camp situation and that we just kill these and then I don't have to fight my way through the entire crash. And it's just these ones. Let's, uh, pounce. That's what you get, Doc. I will ascend. One left. Make way. Right. Never a dull moment. Well, that crash training room was illuminating. A gith instructor's always so brutal. My own Savage would never have threatened a youngling. A waste of time and energy. The pupils themselves culled the weak from their ranks. I myself felled four of my own classmates once Kaleer had a hundred times circled Tyrell. Well, for what reason? Rage? Entertainment? Survival. My people have no use for cowards. Every trainee that I slayed was either too weak to withstand the lessons, or was cocky enough to pick a fight they could never win. 
They underestimated me, so they paid the price. The Githyanki are only as powerful as their weakest warrior. Jaquith de Venzir, the termination of the frail, strengthens us. Okay. I have a lot on my mind. Well, in it. A short sword. A robe. An amulet that gives ancient grudges. And has advantage on intelligence saving throws. A key to the infirmary. Let's see if there's any good loot on anyone. Resisting the urge to take absolutely everything and sell everything. Ring of Elemental Infusion. When you deal acid, cold, fire, lightning, or thunder using a spell or a cantrip, that element infuses your weapon. And a Githyanki longsword. A ruby ring. Githyanki half plate. Infirmary key. Six to fifteen on the Githyanki longsword. Send these to a starion. I've got a long road ahead. Oh, better than nothing. Okay, check these loots. A spicy sausage link and some bread. Wow, you were the uh, chef over here. A divine bone shard. Red apple for the camp. Get Yankee crossbow. Should mind my step. Check that backpack. What's inside? That's what you get for killing that cat. Fruit porridge. Okay, well now... Oh, another chest. Here's hoping that this hasn't sort of alarmed every Githyanki in the building. Come on, everyone. Can we just... Let's see. Keep that... Keep that too. There we go. Oh, he's still scrubbing away. You did this. No, no, I didn't. The Inquisitor is going to gut us one by one, and it's all your fault. I didn't do anything. Hatchery. I'd expect to see fifteen eggs at the very least. For dragons. A rustic dark outfit. What's it look like? Kind of cool. A cozy blue shirt, an old floppy hat, and an ignoble hat. I have something to ask. Is Stick are permitted to view the birthing pools now? These are strange times. Step carefully while here. Our hatchery is protected by lethal safeguards. I do not wish to pick your remains from them. I thought a hatchery would have more eggs. Most are hatched. Only one remains. Monitored by Varshkok, the caretaker of our young. You may speak to the Vash if you wish, but stay away from the egg. There will be no second warning. What would happen if I pushed him into this acid? Right. Let's go 
have a look. Shadow Heart, what are you doing, silly? Oh! Watch the mi- Watch the mines, everyone. Why would you jump back down there? What? Why? You literally said I was okay to come here and have a conversation with you. Am I crazy? Reload. This is what we'll do. Watch your back. Oh, enough waiting. I crave blood. Give you the jumps. You can go talk to him. Delay. You can tell Kithrak Therazin that my position has not changed. The egg requires more time. Furthermore. Oh. Githyanki with facial hair is hilarious. What are you doing here? I wanted to see the hatchery. Almost all of the eggs in his clutch have hatched. We await only one more. Are we about to steal an egg and get a pet dragon? It's time. Most caretakers would not give the child its fair chance. But I shall. There could be greatness in that shell. You note that the hope in his voice is tinged with weariness. It's the voice of a man who's fought the inevitable for a long time. Some eggs simply fail. Why do you care so much for this one? a dangerous world out there. I'm sure you know that. We cannot afford to discard warriors because we are simply impatient. Time for you to leave, I think, kin. And do not touch the egg. Enough. I want the egg. Let me try again. She can jump so ridiculously far. Like, my gosh. I wish Karlak could do that. You can tell Kithrak Therizin you are not from Kreshilek. There is little, most care. You note that the hope in his voice is tinged with weariness. It's the voice of a man who's fought the inevitable for a nice. long time. Nice. With the 20. Not all that arrive late are weak. I created this entire hatchery, despite being the last of my clutch to hatch. They almost drowned me in the hatching pool, if it wasn't for the Vash of my clutch. This one deserves the same chance. Let me help. I can take it somewhere safe. Okay. Not okay. We're going to use an inspiration and try again. Good. Oof. You? You've no Vash instincts about you at all. Still, the captain's due for an inspection any day now. And if she sees it here... Tell me. What would you do with it if I entrust it to you? I would... Make the best omelette you've ever tasted. Omelette. Raise it as if it were my own flesh and blood. I'll see it becomes the greatest geek slayer you've ever seen. Not an easy task. And far harder without a crash to train it in. But... You've a spirit about you that's quite inspiring. Perhaps even equal to the challenge. I can no longer ignore that Kithrak Therizin's patience has its limits. 
Very well. Here. Take these. They will aid your approach to the egg. Boots. Oh, when we put the boots on. Acid services don't affect you. Lands on the egg. Fine Githyanki egg. At least on the outside. You can see a vague outline of something within it. What is it? Touch it. The egg is warm to the touch. The rough shell like slate beneath your fingers. Whatever is within is stirring ever so slightly. Pick it up gingerly. And stow it in your pack. You've caught the egg, haven't you? Be on your way then. Okay. Sorry, I should be being polite and saying goodbye. Alright, guys, I got an egg. Let's go. Can't give up now. Are you meant to just, like, maybe you throw it and something comes out of it? I don't know. Anyway, give it to me. I'll take care of it. I'm encumbered. Send some things to camp then. The clothes. Still encumbered. I think the camp supplies can go there, right? And be used. I don't think I actually have to carry those. Onward. See what else is in this place. What's in the journal? What's the latest here? Githyanki crash complete. We attempted to remove our parasites using the purification device, but it failed and almost killed us. Our parasites must be very unusual. Oh. I guess then I'm kind of done here other than exploring and seeing what else is around. So that was the training room. Oh, okay, it wasn't that guy. He's still in there. No A waypoint. Crash. I'm sure you would. Likely before they'd had the chance to say anything useful. Now is Tick wander our halls at their leisure. Captain Therizan will be even more irate than usual. Hmm. Please, Chitrai, I can explain. The latest batch of cultists knew nothing of the Astral Prism. They were just trying to find Moonrise. They all head there. My Gish have drafted plans to assault the tower. They are ready to fight, Chitrai. We could sift the missing artifact from the tower's ashes if you would give us- Quiet. Find the astral prism, Therizin. My patience falters. Yes, Chitrai. You heard him. Go! Do as she says. She remains your Kithrak. For now. Wait, where are they all going? I was getting a delivery. What happened? What did we miss?
better go watch what I recorded. Okay, I caught up on the fact that they were just running out to do something. I'm not here. Speak to the captain. Captain? Whoa, what's happening here? You got some big wolves. Hello. Why don't I have this? <gasps> She's scared of the wolves. I forgot. Won't say a dwarf, armor and all. Took me a whole ten day to pass him. Um, do you want to just wait outside? No time to waste. Have to keep pushing. She's afraid. She can go stand by the door. Looking ahead. An istic in my crash. You are one of the mercenaries sent to bring the weapon. The Istic is with me, honored Kithrak. So noted. But my question goes unanswered. Do you bring the weapon? Don't tell her anything. Um. Right. I was granted by your entry by your sentries. They told me to seek the Inquisitor. The Inquisitor? On what grounds? I have important information. Information? If it's not about the weapon we seek, I don't care. I told you, they will stop at nothing to reclaim it. Deception. Big one. Oof. Well. And yet your face betrays you. You found it, didn't you? Uh-oh. Shema is Allah Give it to me! No. No? Then I will take it from your corpse! Man, this crash is a real Shut fight, up. isn't it? So much combat in this one. Nice. Then stop wasting my time, Istik. You are one of the mercenaries we engaged, are you not? Of course. I'll be back on the search immediately. What's the reward again? A fortune in gold. Vouched for by our queen herself. I have business to attend to. Return with the weapon, or do not return at all. Gotcha. What's this thing there? Hmm. Where does it go? Let's bury it off. She has it. In her pocket. I wonder. Well, hello. If we couldn't do a little bit of Let's be feeling quick. from this angle. Let's get to the shadows. Whilst her back is turned. Good lad. Tread carefully. Guys, I got it. What if we just, um, pop that in there? Who would be? Oh, it is you. Make haste. We have business to conduct. Oh. The thief's been emptying oh. pockets around here. You might want to allay some suspicions before things get out of hand. Uh, we know nothing about it. You have a convincing air of innocence about you. That's enough for now. Hmm. Bye. The thief's been oh. picking pockets near here. This would be a good moment to explain yourself. 
talk your way out of it with persuasion. I don't even know who's being spoken to. Astarian. Okay. Are you are you about to question every single one of us? You may have talked your. Shall we? We'll just be leaving now. Thank you. And you're not going to notice a damn thing. Lazel? Lazel? Um. <clears throat> Objective noted. <laughs> um. Do you just want to, like, come catch up? I, uh. Left you behind when you got the egg. Oops. Just, um. Go this way. So when I reloaded my save to do the conversation with the one that attacked us with the wolves again, I had to redo the egg stuff because I hadn't saved it. And I'm so surprised I didn't auto save, actually. So I still had her ungrouped. I'm very surprised they're not angry at us for it's going through here. So but I'm progress. glad for it. Moving ahead. So much combat in this place. This place is even more foreboding than the rest of the crash. <laughs> it's unnerving. This place makes my skin crawl. Let's see what this is all about. Do you think this inquisitor person is really going to help us? Only one way to find out. Simple before. I don't know why it would be now. save it at this point. The Inquisitor's Chamber. Very well. Ah, our esteemed... My Arden spoke of one of our kin that escaped a crashing geek slave vessel. Try. Vlacketh's justice in flesh. You have accomplished much, child. I am pleased to finally meet you. I heard there is so much goblin blood on your hands that it soaks their children's nightmares. To business. I suspect you plucked something precious from the Geek ship. Something that belongs to us. The weapon. Give it to me. Don't do it. The weapon is how I protect you. Do it. Do not disobey the Inquisitor. Produce the artifact. What do I get in return? What does it do? I can't. It protects me. Indeed. And what does it protect you from? Mm. The dark? The tadpole in my head. You are infected. Grotesque. No matter. Death will cure you of that problem. Oh. Why are you... I know you're a warrior people, right? But why is everything a fight with you guys? Like, that's not even a roll. Man, they are picking on a Starion big time. Right, let's get in there. Thank you. Got to move. So many hits. Oh yeah, I need to switch past without trace back out, don't I? Let me... Hit you with some ice. Miss. 
I'm just going to straight up owl barracks. It's so powerful. make something happen. Please. Critical but parried. Let's get behind here. Actually, wait, wasn't there someone else here causing an issue? There is someone that right there, yeah. Finish this person. Action surge. Don't miss. Right. You need to break this spell that's on you somehow. Hit him with the ray of sickness. Nice. That'll do it. Get yourself away. being misty. High defense for that 35, 75. Miss. Stealing everyone's mind. Can't reach destination. I want like a far reaching healing, but if I disengage from you. I then get him. Take you, you. Okay. That's good.
I'll join you. I can't hit you, though. That's cheating, surely. And this. Right. I will not know failure. Critical hit. And a pommel. Can you hit him? You're a little damaged. A little damaged boy, aren't you? In so many ways. Where are those potions I sent you? Or was that on a save that we didn't change from? I definitely gave you potions. Wow. Astarian down three or four times so far in this fight. Oh, right next to me. Oh dear. He hit pretty hard. What can we hit here? Try and finish this guy. 5%! Oh my gosh. I am all out of spells with Shadow Heart. Trying to make it so it would hit you and not us, and I just hit absolutely no one. Wild shape again. This time. Nope, just keep wild owl bearing, it's so powerful. Good. I gotta help Astarian. Can't reach him and don't have a thing. Gotcha. It's like some bonding time for us, really, isn't it? Spill some blood. I They just love killing Asarian so much. Big hit. I love playing as the Albear, it's so good. Oh, they're so nearly done. Nice. Good 
the job. Inquisitor Wawargaz was potent. We are impressed. My queen. Shkarthai. You are permitted to look upon me. You are invited to me. The Deathless Queen has spoken. You will obey. Who am I? I am Vlagilith, undying queen of the noble Githyanki, god regent of the Six Arms of Tornara! choice of allies is most vexing. They do not become you, Blazel. Chma Zala Vlaketh. You know me. Erlon of Kalir speaks most highly, as did Archaia before. You seek purity. I may yet grant it. Istic. You bear that which is ours. But are you friend, or are you thief? Ooh. Neither. It's mine by rights. No! It is not yours. To own something is to know it. That weapon you carry. The astral prison. It is corrupted. I will cleanse it for you, my queen. Tell me how. There is someone inside. Someone? Their mind is warped. My guardian? Broken. A blight. They are an agent of the grand design. Sent to sabotage the astral prison. Our last defense against the return of the Elithid Empire. is compromised. Kill them! Do this, and I will cleanse you and your allies. Do this, and ascend! Ascension. My queen. An honor gained. A burden borne. You must accept. Refuse, and you will know my fury. I'm not giving up the little goblin. Can't you kill them yourself? Thought gods were all powerful. Perhaps I misheard. You would not speak ill of a god, would you? Darling, it's giving a Wizard of Oz, and I'm about to pull the plug. I think a real god could kill whoever she wants. Oh. You weren't bluffing? Well... Damn. And my... <laughs> my punishment for not believing is I have to do that whole fight all over again. I'm so sorry. My lady. Wow. So I'm back after doing that fight again. Now, Lazelle died during the fight, so she's currently dead. Obviously, I would use a scroll to bring her back, but because this cutscene starts immediately after the fight, she's technically not in this conversation, which I guess is a good thing and a bad thing, because obviously what I'm about to do is really going to disappoint her, but... Yeah, a bit annoying, because it took me like three goes to get through that fight. It's a hard fight. Ah, <sighs> stand tall. You are her equal in iniquity. You bear that 
which is ours. But are you friend or are you thief? Hmm. I didn't steal it, it just found me. this feeling in a former life I did refuse you and uh, met your fury quite well so I think I'll do what you say this time <laughs> detect thoughts hopefully this doesn't annoy her detect the thoughts of a god what why did that not take the other dice what Music's way too loud in the scene. Death, fear, paranoia. She fears the one inside the artifact more than anything in the world. Mm. But she's hiding something. The veil snaps back. She's back afraid. His mind shut out to you forever. Interesting. I look so cool right now, looking up like that, all covered in blood. Forget damaged Astaria and take damaged me. Look at me. You just want to, like, dab some bandages and gores on my wounds and stuff? Sorry. Um, uh, the dream visitor is inside the artifact. I, I can't kill them. They protect me. You are being lied to. I will be obeyed. really see my eye here. The replaced one. Fine. We will obey, because we don't want to get smited. Use the plane caster's power to enter the prison. Be wary of the creature's lying tongue. Cut it out if you must. I know, Shadowheart, I know you disapprove, and I'm sorry, but... You'll have to trust me. What happens is not good. Starion? Come on. On your feet. Lizelle? Back. The Undying Queen has spoken. Insert the artifact into the Crescent Plane Caster. We will kill the threat inside. And I will have Lacket's eternal regard. She will cleanse me. She will ascend me. Okay, well, I'm glad you heard all that whilst you were dead, because I was worried that you had missed your opportunity to meet your lady. So it looks like we'll be stepping through this and going to an astral plane. Let's take a look. If you want to find out what happens next, click that video on the screen. Once that video is out, I will put it right there. If it's not there yet, then it's just one of my other favorite videos, and I thank you for your patience whilst I get the next part out. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day.